Hey guys, Chris here for Tolman's Guitars and Basses. This time, I'm comparing affordable Telecasters and Tele-shaped instruments. <laughs> this is the first instrument. We have four of them, and all four are at a different price point, really. It's really hard to find anything that competes with the Harley Benton TE62, which comes in under 200 euros. Uh, so what I did is grabbed four of the most relevant T-style guitars. Uh, one of them is this one. Uh, the other one is a Squire Affinity Tally, that one right over there. Then the Larry Carlton T3 and the mighty GNL Asset Classic. Before I start comparing these guitars, a short reminder, we made three videos on strats. Comparison rounds for affordable strats, mid-priced and really expensive ones. So uh, if you like strats, make sure to check those videos out. You'll find the links in the description below. I also explain the rig I'm using today. It's pretty simple, but still, it's pretty relevant too. I'll talk about that after the clean comparison rounds. So let's go. All right, let's talk about the rig. It's pretty simple. We have the guitar going into the UAFX Golden Reverberator for some reverb, and then uh, we go into the Fender Deluxe Reverb Combos normal channel. There's no reverb on the amp, nothing. And now let's move on to the second round, which is the overdriven comparison. The only thing that changes is that I put the Kessler Toxic Twins in the signal chain, which is um, a very nice low gain, pretty transparent blues breaker style overdrive. Let's go for it. Thank you. 
All right, now that you made up your mind, probably, I think it's all right to let you know what my experience was here in the room while I was playing these four guitars. Uh, the price difference is pretty radical here. So we're going from 180-ish euros for the Harley Benton up to 600 and something, 80 euros, something like that. In Germany right now, prices of course change. So as told, check the links in the description box for current uh, prices and situations and which is available, etc. They're all built really well, like surprisingly well, especially for the more inexpensive ones. Um, in terms of tone, there is a huge difference, of course, and even in terms of output, because these pickups, these are the MFD Slinger coils, um, which are Leo Fender designed GNL pickups. These are so much louder and clearer and just more is more, <laughs> those kind of pickups compared to any of the other ones. The Larry Carlton also had um, a a bit more output for sure than the Squire and the Harley Benton. And uh, that also helped, of course, to get a bit more sustain and all those things, of course. Uh, you can simulate that with a, a, a clean boost between the guitar and the drive pedal or between the guitar and the amp. Uh, but just out of the box, there are big differences in the output of these pickups. Um, I loved the neck of the Larry Carlton most. It just has a nice and full neck, really cool rounded off edges. So that, that was my, my number one, even though as told, all four are really nice to play. Um, and in terms of weight, this is killer because it's a, it's a hollow body. It's, it's hollow inside, well, most of it at least. And it's swamp edge, it just looks beautiful. So even though it's the most expensive one, I, I have to admit this is also the one that, that caught my attention most. Um, not sure about the pickups, it's a, it's a taste thing if you like really loud pickups or more mellow ones. Uh, but this guitar, as it is right now, sings like crazy. The Harley Benton is the biggest, like the most impressive one because of its price compared to what you get. Uh, the Squire Affinity is a huge, huge upgrade compared to the old Affinity series, so the neck is just one of the nicest ones out of the really um, inexpensive ones and just overall really nice uh, yeah, playing feel. All right, let me know in the comments below what you think about these four guitars. Uh, what kind of uh, tellies and telly style guitars do you want to see in the other two videos that we're making for sure, which is going to be a mid-priced and a really expensive telly shootout. Subscribe to the channel if you don't want to miss any of these videos and uh, see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>